Happy Sunshine family. Welcome back to the Lunacy Channel. I was just getting back after another long day and looked at the National Hurricane Center and that's something that that I'm going to talk about here. We've got Maria that's moved north and east up here. It's a tropical storm now. Lee is a hurricane. I saw this X down here, guys, and I've never seen an X on this map. I, I haven't been watching it for that long, but an X seemed pretty interesting. I do they even have a... Yeah, so here's the X's. It says, Disturbance 1, 40% chance of cyclone formation in 48 hours. <clears throat> As of 2 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time, Friday, September 29, 2017, a large area of cloudiness and showers extending from the northwestern Caribbean Sea <clears throat> northward across Cuba to southern Florida and the northwestern Bahamas is associated with a broad surface trough interacting with an upper-level low. A weak area of low pressure is likely to form from this weather system later today and move northward near the east coast of Florida of the Florida Peninsula through Saturday. <clears throat> Environmental conditions appear conducive for some development of this system during the next couple of days before upper level winds become less favorable. <clears throat> Sunday night or Sunday. Regardless of development, this system is likely to produce locally heavy rainfall over portions of central and western Cuba, the Florida Keys, the Florida Peninsula, and the northwestern Bahamas during the next several days. Formation, whoops, formation chance through 48 hours is medium, 40%. Formation chance through 5 days is also 40%. So there's a 40% chance of a cyclone formation within 48 hours at the same place that we saw Hurricane Irma just magically appear on the reflective radar. I mean, now they're not making one quote-unquote out in the middle of the ocean. And giving us these tracks and everything. Now they're just saying, oh, conditions are right. The same place that Irma just magically appeared on the radar. Yeah, 40% chance that one's going to form there in two days. Let's check. The National High Resolution Reflectivity Composite Loop. Well, we've got some moisture moving north from that area where they say there's a 40% chance of cyclone development. I mean, this, the southeast is just off the hook here with the radar, guys. And wow, look at Minnesota's radar. Wow, totally frying. Looks like that northwestern spike from Houston is flashing right now. There's a bunch of other spikes. <clears throat> I mean, that's that's really amazing right up here in Minnesota, guys, and in Wisconsin. All right. Well, let's see what we've got going on. Earth.nullschool.net. All right, so this is Maria and Lee right over here. And this is the big UK cyclone and Dealey Wop that we've been watching for quite a while. I think. 
one of the YouTube channels that I saw today was talking about Maria and Lee meeting up with whatever this is and then heading on into the UK. I don't, I really don't know what to say about any of this forecasting, any of this 40% chance of a cyclone to just develop here within two days. Um, it really looks to me that our weather is completely man-made and scheduled. And I sure know I didn't consent to any of it. If any of you consent to this, leave a comment down below. All right, well, that's about all I've got energy for today. I love you guys a lot. I'm glad we're about done with this month. <laughs> I didn't even have a weather. <laughs> I got, I've got snooker up on the other station or on the other window. Oh, wow. What? <clears throat> well, this is just going to go up this way. All right, guys. I love you guys. Peace out. Bye-bye.